Water Pressure Sensor Installation The water pressure sensor, when properly installed, will sense when an irrigation starts and stops, how long the line takes to pressurize and depressurize, and record the PSI in the line for the entire irrigation. Start by gathering the necessary equipment. You will receive the sensor, cable, and coupler from Aquaspy. You'll also need a hose cutter, thread tape or plumber's tape, and the appropriately sized tee fitting for your line. Wrap thread tape around the threads of the sensor and the coupler. Then firmly screw the coupler onto the sensor. Next, attach the tee fitting to the other end of the coupler. Ensure both connections are hand tightened securely. Install the T fitting and sensor in the drip line between two emitters and within the cable range of the CT. Position it close to the CT to minimize cable burial. If the drip line is slack, you can cut out a small section for the T fitting as seen here. For a taut line, make only one cut. For a solid set, we recommend cutting at the bottom of the sprinkler riser and attaching a standard PVC T fitting there. Rejoin the line by inserting the T fitting into the line, then tightening down each end firmly by hand. Once the T and sensor are firmly installed into the line, you can connect the male end of the pigtail into the six pin accessory port on the back of the CT. Do not plug the pigtail into the 4-pin pro port. If installing onto an existing site, you may need a 5 16 inch driver or socket to loosen the hose clamps and lower the CT. Power on the CT and listen for the audio checks. The CT should search for the probe first, followed by the water pressure sensor. You will hear this message if the sensor is connected properly. Pressure sensor detected. Wait for the CT to finish all checks, indicated by a tone and the message, data upload successful. You can then raise the CT to the desired height, and now you're ready to enjoy the benefits of using a water pressure sensor. For additional guides and tutorials, visit aquaspy.zohodesk.com.